Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Two Bros Game Night. I am your host, Older Bro. And I'm your other host, Younger Bro. And today we continue in Danganronpa. Uh, screw me. Anyways, what the fuck are you talking about? You gotta use the rope to your tug of war or something, idiot. Can't be. I'm not an idiot. Ha uh -huh. You're an idiot. You're an idiot. You. Who are you calling stupid? Uh, I don't think he called you stupid. He said you were an idiot. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, what's wrong, Chihiro? You don't look so great. Oh, I'm just going through a little self-loathing. They should absolutely spend more time with her. <laughs> self-loathing? Well, that's uh, what Mikiata. I can't pronounce his name because he could go fuck off. Said to me yesterday, I, I just get so nervous. I locked up. I couldn't say anything. Mondo ended up having to help me out, and even he said I was... Someone who can't fight back. I, I hate how weak I am. Girl, you're you're you're, you're great. adorable. Ah, uh, see, someone though made you depressed. What? What? How is it my fault? Hey, I wasn't trying to be mean. Besides, girls are just naturally weaker, anyways. Oh, right? you're about to piss <laughs> Owie off. <laughs> are, are you crying? Cause you were screaming like a lunatic. Hey, come on. Uh, don't cry. It's, it's my fault, okay? I, I won't yell Yeah, you better. Really? I'm not sure I can believe that. Huh? Just shut up! Why? I got it. I'll, I'll make Why? you a promise as a man. Huh? Promise as a man? Yeah, that's right. Maybe I mentioned this before, but ever since I was a kid, there was one thing my brother told me over and over again. He said that no matter what, a real man always keeps his promises. That's where he left me. Yes. Oh yeah, uh, my my brother's dead. Uh oh, I uh I see. That's true. A anyway, I don't want to talk about it. Don't want to make all you guys cry. Yo. Anyway, so you can trust me when I make that promise. So you don't gotta cry anymore. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Manyo. <laughs> sure. But but I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get stronger. Maybe go Super Saiyan. If I'm so weak, anything can make me try. That's not good. Uh, still, don't don't stress out too much about having to get stronger. No, I want to get stronger. Maybe I could start working out. Uh, getting physically stronger doesn't help you with emotional support <laughs> problems. Uh, although I guess it would mean you can beat up your problems. But <laughs> if you shut down, I don't think that's gonna matter. But point is, talk to someone like Kyoko. <laughs> She'll help you. May no, wait, that might, Maybe be, that might be a bad idea. Yeah, talk, talk more to Hina. In that case, I would be wow. happy to help you out any time. But then Miss Fujisaki would get smashed into a billion pieces. A Shut up, you. <laughs> you know? Oh, finally cracked a smile, huh? I see. Yeah. Why doesn't he die? He's like the least additive to the story. Everyone, thank you! Looks like Chihiro's finally got some life back in her. Yeah, man, if we keep helping each other out like this, we're bound to get out of this crappy place sooner or later, and this is probably when Monokuma's gonna jump in, right? <laughs> I mean, someday, I'm sure. Still, our biggest concern right now is the other two, who never showed up to breakfast. What can I do to try to understand those two better? Are, are you hinting that I should go and spend time with them, game? Because oh, I don't want to. Like, I would really... Maybe go check Toko, at least. <sighs> See, out of the two of them, that's, she's the one I really don't want to. Really? Because she's, like, the clear Yandere. This guy's an asshole. She's a Yandere. <laughs> and it's like, you don't try to get closer to a Yandere. Or an asshole. So, fine. Where the hell is her room? There right it is. There. Ding dong. Leave me alone, you don't have to pay attention to me! Should I hang out with Toka for a while? For some reason. <laughs> Just do whatever you want, I should have made that. Look, you're not a Sundere, you're a Yandere. Or maybe you're a Yandere hiding as a Sundere? Uh, <laughs> uh, against my better judgment. What? What is this girl good with again? Uh... It's not gaming. Writing? Can I? 
Yeah, I can't actually check, can I? No, I can't. Uh, no, fan fiction. Oh, she's the fan guy's fiction? the fan fiction writer. Uh, love ring status. Glasses, maybe. No, I'm just trying to look, think through things. No. Maybe? I, I actually, see, the problem is I don't know who the fuck would this one would be for. I, I'm trying to look up her ultimate. Emperor of this fuck. What is her name? Toko? Yeah, Toko. Shears. <laughs> I so want this to be what she wants. <laughs> that would make sense. Writing prodigy. She is the writer? She is the writer. Right, she is the writer. So what I do we thought have so. Writing? Yeah, he is the ultimate fanfic creator, I think. But she is the ultimate, ultimate writer, writer. Which is like, what? So, so that, anything writing. That... Typing thing? No, we already got rid of that. <laughs> yeah, she would Shears. appreciate a thumb. Yeah. See, I, part of me wants it to be that, but cassette, the receiver. That's that's, no, that's the other book. Yeah, all these games. Maiden's handbag. Female fanfic fans. She would be... That's like the... The problem is, I can also imagine that guy get liking this. Even I though it's know. not geared towards him. So it's like, I can imagine that working. No. This is... Probably not it. Tour tickets? Uh, uh, yeah, that I was trying to say. He used to distribute a full-length novel based on what the world would look like if all of someone's dreams came true. Sure. Why the hell not? He ain't giving... <clears throat> he giving this to me? Don't think it makes me happy or whatever. It's more annoying than anything. Does, does that mean she liked it? <laughs> she, she's just standing there. Does she want something? But she's not saying anything. <laughs> Maybe I should start a conversation. Hey, Toko! What? You want to talk to me? Well, I can't stop you, so talk already. Okay, but what should I say? Uh, what do you like to do in your spare time? Why do you want to know? I mean, you know, we're trapped here together, right? So we're going to be friends. It'd be nice to get to know each other. <laughs> you, you just said... <laughs> you, you have you said broke the, her. You said the one thing that, like, breaks the fuck out of her. Uh, After that part about being trapped, we're gonna be what? Uh, friends? <laughs> yeah, we have done the wrong thing and gotten close to the andre. What do you mean, friends? You think I'm stupid? You're trying to trick me. I've already been hurt once before. Oh, that's why she. Yeah. I'm not gonna let it happen again. You, you've been hurt. What happened? Anyway. Come on, you don't really care about me. You don't want to know about me, even I know that. You know, that, that's not true. Fine, then tell me. T tell you what? <laughs> you know, they call me the ultimate writing policy, right? Uh, sure, you've won all kinds of literature prizes and stuff. But tell me what I'm good at. Tell me what my genre speciality is. Okay, uh, just, just keep reading. If you really want to convince me, you give a crap, you should at least know that. And we're Googling this because we the don't genre remember. genre that the ultimate writing prodigy specializes in. I... I thought the, it was. Hold on, I, I, I'm not okay. going to risk it. Look it up. If it's this, I want it to be this. Nonfiction is too droll. She would not go for that. Young adult is too general. Romance is the exact specific one. So I'm just like, it has to be this. It's romance, of course. Oh, you actually do. Your, your biggest success was So Lingers the Ocean, right? Everyone yeah, that's what I thought it was. 
The book was such a... Yeah, remember it was the fisherman thing. Yeah. The book was such a hit that fishermen shot to the top of the hottest men poles. How did you know that? Because I'm totally a stalker and looked everybody <laughs> up. There's no way you care about me. I'm telling you, I do. I mean, we're friends, aren't we? I'm blind. Your straightforward nature blinded me. I literally can't lie or hide anything <laughs> for anyone ever. Yeah. Toka ran off screaming like a banshee. Um, does she hate me now or what? <sighs> Fuck you. You have locked the skill of vocabulary. Once we're all done, I head back to my room for a little while. Let me guess, it's night. No, it's not. still time not. left in the day. Yeah, so, okay, perfect. Uh, okay, well, if that's the case, then I'm gonna go spend some time with, uh, somebody else. So, uh, there she is. We'll go spend some more time with her. Because she clearly needs it. Yes. Because I really don't want to spend time with Byaki Yatogami. Uh, Matt, I think please. you went to the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, this is the closest one. I have oh. to run all the way down the damn hall. Wait, are they, is she in the girl's bathroom? Uh, no, okay, no, they're in the, she's, she's in the laundry. In the laundry. Okay, I was like, please, fuck <laughs> Please, God, no. Like, I can't visit that. Did we ever go in the laundry? Yeah, we did go in the laundry room once. Yeah, once. One time. We've been in here. There she is. Yep, they're both in here, so... So what was this one again? That, that was just magazines. World class beauties. Oh, well, I oh. get another Monokuma coin. Wait, so I have to check all these multiple times? Oh my god. I'm only you checking the first three. I know, but I'm saying, like, the Monokuma coins can be in any of them at any time. I know. What's wrong? Do you need something? Should I hang out with Chihiro? Absolutely. Probably. <laughs> you want to sit me down and talk for a while? Oh god, Hogger. You need a hug. I spent some time talking with a necessary hug giver. <laughs> Would you like to give her a present? Absolutely. Okay, she is... She needs one. What is she again? A uh, programmer. Yeah. So we gotta look for... That's that's why I was like, is the game console good for her? Here's why I think the game console works for her. Because uh, it's not a game console. It's a game system that has a touchscreen that can also play music and videos, so it's an all-in-one media machine. So I'm like, uh. this really feels like it works for her. But, like, I don't know. I don't know either. Let me see if there's anything else in here that would even... That's key items. This is some... I a wash base! <laughs> I don't understand that one. This is, like, some spiritual energy bullshit. Well, I wouldn't mind it. This allows you to see demons. Uh, cool. There's, we already did that one. I don't know who the fuck would like this voice changing bow tie. Uh, I, I would think maybe main girl. Yeah, but she doesn't. No, she might. Uh, flashlight. Yeah, see what I'm saying? Like, just none of this seems to, like, How about go for her. Fun so that's why I'm just like, I feel like it has to be this one. So. Like, because the other things are like, uh, whatever the fuck that doll is. Female fanfic fans, I guess could be her. Uh, all of this stuff, like, that's all, we know who that's for. Uh, I don't think the whip. The dandelion. Dandelion, maybe. Yeah, but it's just a loves me, or like, it's just a, like, love me, love me not kind of toy. So I don't think that's Maybe for her, right? Maybe the Sunaray would want that one. Yeah, but like, <laughs> probably. Uh, but I hope not. I don't. It's romance related. See, that could also be the romance girl. This thing, collectible, but that we know who that's for. No. Honestly, this it could literally be this for all I know. Legendary punk rocker. I would give that to the motorcycle guy. Yeah. This we know is who's for the bunny earmuffs. So that's the thing. Is it, is it literally just cute? Because she's the programmer. So it's like I feel like it shouldn't just be cute for her. Ay, fuck it. We'll just do the damn game. Video game. I've got no fucking clue. Uh, where the fuck is it? There it is. 
if this isn't it either, it's going to kind of piss me off. Like if, if it's none of if, if it's not this, I have no idea what. Thank you. Thank you, Makoto. Of course it is. Of course it is. Going through all this strife wow. of which one is it? No, it's this one. Of course it is. Of course. <laughs> of course the, the coder wants a yeah. video game. This is the first time I've ever gotten something like a this. A video game? Wow. Wait, there's also games for this video game. Does that mean once you give her this, you just give her every fucking game that you have for this system? Yeah. Holy shit. I get the impression she liked it. That's good. Well, I guess the, good, the one good. guy must, might also have. Yeah. So. Aww. What's wrong? Did you say sigh? That seemed like <laughs> a pretty heavy sigh. Yeah, like, also you said sigh instead of sighing. <laughs> Oh, sorry. It's just some everyone else is working so hard to get us out of here, but I'm no help at all. It's oh, she, you're so God, precious. My precious gift from above. That's not true at all. But... It's okay. You don't have to try and make me feel better. I know it's the truth. Give her a hug now. Yeah, I'm gonna please. I'm going to leave you without a computer in front of me. At least if I were a little stronger or something, then I'd be able to help somehow. Mm -hmm. Listen, you'll get your chance. I'm sure there'll be a time when your skills will come in handy. Oh, fuck. I just realized the joke they made in the abridged is now entirely inappropriate. Which makes it ultra appropriate. Uh... Okay, I'm going to close that spoiler warning out. All these characters, I think, have a secret spoiler warning. Uh... So, like, I now have two of the character spoiler warnings. Just looking up shit. So, anyways, so you don't have to worry so much, okay? My skills might come in handy. Yeah, you're a programmer. Like, yeah. there's a computer upstairs that's not plugged in. Go or, check it it's out. It's not working. Like, <laughs> if I get a chance, I'm going to work super hard to chip in. When it comes to computers, you can kill on me. Yeah, she she is she does machines. She's uh, yeah. She's done a tele. You're right about that. No matter what anyone might say, you're still the ultimate programmer, and that makes you awesome. Yeah. Anyways, how'd you get into programming? Uh-huh. Well, I, I mean, I always assumed most programmers were guys, so... <sighs> Is it really that weird? No, nothing like that. I was, I was just curious what got you interested in it. I mean, why programming all things? Why? I mean, there isn't much of a reason. I do a lot of MMD stuff. I'm always been kind of weak, you know. I Why did never, that music suddenly change? I was never able to run around with my friends or anything. We had a computer at home, so I'd kill time poking around with it. And I found out I really liked it. You know, my my my, uh, my family was really concerned when the computer suddenly started, <laughs> like, uh, becoming Coming sentient. <laughs> yeah, it had, like, 13 Xeon processes in it or something. It. Yeah, it was fun. My dad was a software engineer, and he had a bunch of programs on there that he'd built. Yeah, that makes sense. I found one of them and started playing around with it, adding stuff here and there. And that was how I ended up making my very first program. Interesting. What kind of program was it? That shitty program that my school used. <laughs> a kind of database software. Database software? A user could communicate with it, and it would take... That information and find what they were looking for. So in other words, for. she invented in Google. Google search engine. <laughs> it's a way of interacting with the computer without having to physically type things oh, out. No, no, no. She uh, invented AI Google, Google search engine. Why? Like you know, you remember the joke in uh, oh. remember in Wreck It Ralph two? They had the joke where the the fucking guy who was Google was talking to you and trying to predict what you said. Yeah. She invented that guy. <laughs> She said it could understand the user without them having to type things out. So that would be... Yeah, voice recognition. Use voice recognition, is that it? Yep, exactly! You could talk to it, and it could actually talk back. It was a lot of fun. So, okay, Google. Yeah. <laughs> it didn't even really sound like me. I would get totally absorbed in talking to it. Wait, it what? didn't sound like... What? It's like a kid recording themselves and playing Aww. it back again. Oh, okay, she used her voice, right. Um, the key part of program was getting it to recognize what I was saying. The recognition accuracy was the most important thing. Japanese is kind of hard, so it was pretty challenging. I mean, wait, which Japanese? 
cla classical Japanese, like oh. the kind that's based on Chinese that has characters for every single oh, goddamn man. word. Because if so, yeah. Yeah. But you were able to do it eventually? Yep. Why do you think I'm talking to you in Japanese right now? <laughs> anyway. Right I, around then. I know. My dad found out I'm, I'd messed with his software without permission. I thought I was going to get in so much trouble. But all he said was how pressed he was. The software was able to take natural speech and pull out key search terms to receive information. Blah, blah, blah. Boring stuff. Just make out with me already. <laughs> My dad said it works Honestly, so well. honestly to her, this probably is her making out with you it right now. It was going to change this The fact that you're keep, yeah, like, keeping up with what she's saying is yeah. close enough. The development costs are still pretty expensive, so it hasn't spread that much did yet. you contact but... google now fuck that don't contact google um uh -huh. you're japanese contact uh japanese version of google that's still google, google. But like <laughs> okay that's the that is that's the israeli version of google <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> I couldn't tell you how happy it made me to be able to make others happy. It's obvious how much you love computers. You seem to light up when you start talking about them. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's been a uh, Yeah, so it's anything tech. That, yeah. It's not even program. It's just tech Tech stuff. based. No, I had a lot of fun learning more about you. It's fine. Huh? Oh, really? Yeah, I hope you tell me even more next time. Okay, let's hang out more next time. Yeah. She just claps her hands so excited. Jumps up and down. Yeah. Yay. God. Yeah, try to. Yeah, good luck finding a clip of that. I've only seen that in one anime, and I don't even know where I watched it from. Is it problem? Is it okay? I'll do what I can. Assuming I'm allowed to. I swear it was in one of the chibi. You unlock the skill algorithm. Okay. Finally. I swear it was in one of the chibi anime. I parted ways me. with Chihiro. Okay, so we probably have at least one more day of free time before somebody dies or whatever. I guess I'm feeling a little hungry. Let me get something to eat. I should head to the dining hall, I guess? Well, this is a bad sign. <laughs> You're going out alone at night? Well, it's not night time yet. I know. I just wanted to get something to eat, and now I'm about to get roped into something like this. I'm actually already roped in. Oh. Hey, my girl, perfect timing! What's going on? Uh -huh. I have a favor to ask. A favor? I have a bad feeling about this. Uh oh. In fact, I have a really bad feeling about this because I'm pretty sure it's going to take way too long, but I'm doing it anyways. It. Come on, Makoto. you got to be our witness. Who will be a witness for our lord? Fuck. A witness to what? what? This guy's been talking shit about me since day one. Call me a coward and shit like that. You are a coward. That's why you turn to violence to solve your problems, huh? That's why you can't do what society asks you. Why you walk around dressed like that, huh? The fuck you say? You're no shit! You You've already lost yourself, but you're such a coward you don't even realize it, huh? So what you're saying I'm, you're not a coward? You think you're tougher than me? I know I am, huh? Okay, let's slow down. Prove you got what I don't. I accept your challenge, huh? So that's what's happening, Makito. You gotta be our witness. You gotta throw down? You're not gonna, like, punch each other, are you? There's a bathhouse on the first floor of the dorm, right? The sawn inside? I see. A simple endurance contest. Is that it? Ah. Uh, we're going to see who can stay in the sauna the longest, am I right? If you uh, die in the sauna from this contest, who gets the murder tag? One of them that survives, or you, the witness? That's a good question. Or is it suicide? <laughs> This thing, if you stay in the uh, sauna long enough, can you actually die? Probably, like from heat stroke. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I think the goddamn straight. I'm pretty sure the longest someone can stay in there is probably yeah, because they put uh, warnings on there like saying please don't like fall asleep in here and like especially in hot tubs and stuff. They say that, and I think it's in saunas as well. Like only stay in here for like 30 minutes at most. Yeah. So. Yeah, because. Anyways, so I think the I longest someone was in there was I think someone got locked in a. Uh, sauna one time, and yeah. he was in there for 24 hours. Exactly. Are you guys really gonna go through with this? Shit, yeah. He'll be done in a matter of minutes anyway. 
People like him are without exception. All talk. Uh, bring it on! Hell, let's make things interesting. Wouldn't want to win without a challenge, right? Interesting. We're gonna battle with all our clothes on. That's idiotic, suicidal. Ah. Uh. What, you afraid? I'm afraid of budget change, yes. You're going to regret this. Uh. Shovel, let's do it! Wait, but he doesn't have all of his clothes on. Yeah, so doesn't that <laughs> make him automatically fail? This school environment doesn't give a shit about your school environment! Whoa. Hey, Mondo! What, what asshole? Take off your uniform, you, know? Go ahead. you can't... Wait, did he talk? Yeah, you did. And you can yeah, they're all talking. Up and mind your own oh, boy, it's... I mean, look at your face is all red. What are you, one of those goddamn hot spring monkeys? Just he so looks like Goku. I was or Vegeta. With a red face. You don't have to act all big, man. Act, you say? <laughs> I'm still plenty good to go. I'm so good. Uh, I could eat a steaming hot bowl of soup right now. Okay. Are they okay? A few minutes pass, then a dozen, then an hour. Don't you think it's about time? If you pass out in there, I'll get blamed for murder. Come yeah, out! You. you can't even hardly talk. Dumbass. Say oh what boy. Ever you want. I'm still <laughs> totally good to go. In fact, I'm starting to feel uh, kind of cold. <laughs> you lying sack of shit. That's probably not good. <laughs> That's probably not good. Hey, guys, I know you want to prove how big and badass you are, but I think you've done enough. Oh, shit. I just can't win. Ding dong, bing bong! Please get out now, guys! I hope he just says, guys, get out of the shower. <laughs> Nighttime. Oh, they got locked in the sauna. No, the water turns off. Oh. Did you hear that? It's nighttime. How would you call it a tie? In a true competition, there's no such thing as a tie. You Fuck. Win, or you lose. The only thing that matters. Listen to you, you son of a bitch, and bring it on. I'll, I'll push you right up to the gates of hell. Everything's on fire. You're already there. The gates of hell. That's not a good place to push someone. Okay, guys, we're gonna stop here and come back next time. These idiots. Until then, remember the future is very uncertain. But what is certain is you guys are awesome and not as crazy as these two. Also, more Two Bros game night tomorrow. See you then. Goodbye.